Welcome back to a, another session of our Star Wars Knights of the Republic Dark Side playthrough. We're going to pick all the Dark Side and Evil options that we can. So far, we're doing an okay job. Um, but we have plenty of game left before we can uh, do more stuff. So, um, also, today's session is going to be pretty quick like two hours at the most, maybe a little bit more, but. Um, uh, I don't normally stream on Mondays anyway, and uh, but I did feel like doing it today, so we're going to do a, a little quickie if we can. So let's go ahead and load it in right here. Uh, last thing that we did was we finished all the Undercity stuff. Uh, we talked to the... Uh, village leader down there we explored all around the gated area with all the rat ghouls and stuff we went uh down into the sewers and we freed zalbar because we we uh met mission in the uh the undercity um and then we went down to the sewers we did all that stuff we went to the black volker base and we did not we did not get the um, the swoop accelerator thing because there was a sort of a uh, another deal that uh, that came up, and we are going to go that way because it's more evil. So I think it's under this one here. Also, I forgot to turn off the FPS counter. Oof. Uh, I really need to... I like to leave that on because when I play, uh, like, Dark Souls or Cyberpunk or whatever, I like to see the FPS, especially in Cyberpunk, so... Um, but yeah. So, Kaden... Kanden Ark, uh, one of the Black Volkers has given you a counter to Gadanthek's offer. He claims that if you kill the Hidden Beck leader, then Bredjik and the Black Volkers will sponsor your entry into the swoop race so we still get to do the swoop race i at first i thought we would skip it if we took his offer but we still have to race uh where bass was being offered up as part of the champion's prize so we are going to go ahead and uh kill gadanthek I've, I've never done that before i don't know how that goes um we're gonna we're gonna give it a try and see what happens um And then I think that was pretty much it. My character's still level 2. I'm still holding out on levels. I actually don't know what level I would be right now. If I did level, probably like 5 or 6 maybe if I'm lucky. Um, Actually probably more than 6. Probably be 7 probably. Because 2100 for level 7. Um, so yeah, there's there's that. Let's see, we walked out of the base. And then what do we got here? Undercity. Oh yeah, I should probably run to the Undercity real fast. I do have something that I need to turn in over there. Remember those, uh, the Rukiel's Apprentice thing? We have to do that. We also found the journals. So I probably need to turn that in. Um, let's go to, let's go to the hideout, heal up, come back. And then go back down there real fast and turn those in. Before we go and attack the hidden back base. Gotta run all the way down here. All the way down. Yeah, I'm interested to see more of this dark side playthrough and see how... Uh, how things uh, escalate later on in the game, especially when you get more party members. Some some of them might be, uh, yeah, we like it when you pick the dark side option. And some of them might be like, I'm gonna leave your party if you keep doing this. I actually don't know how that works. Da -da -da -da. Gotta pass this guy. Just go down to the Undercity real fast, and then come back up. And then, um, Hidden Beck Base. And then we still have to do, 
We still have to try to do... Um, what is it? Um, we still have to try to do the dueling ring. That's going to be hard to do at level 2, but I know I have a bunch of um, like grenades and stuff, so I might be able to cheese it just doing that. So let me turn this in. Greetings once more, Upworlder. Uh, your apprentice is dead. I have her journal. So we'll give that to, her, to him. It is as I feared, then. She joins the list of those who have given their lives in the service of our cause. But though I am saddened by this news, there is yet hope. By finding my apprentice, you have proved yourself worthy, Upworlder. You are to be the beacon on our path to salvation. You will guide us to the promised land. The promised land. Guide you? I don't even know where the promised land is. And why should I guide you anywhere? Let's say that. You are marked, Upworlder. Even my dim old eyes can see the mantle of destiny that cloaks you. Perhaps old Rukil knows you better than you know yourself. I am old. I have lived a hundred years in the Undercity, cast down into the darkness. I know the legends and history of our people, and now you must learn it too. I'm not interested in the history of your people. I don't know. We'll see. I, I did look up this quest when um, I was editing the videos and uh, there's a way to get dark side points but I don't know if talking to him like this is going to give it to me but we'll see if not we can just reload and I I know how to get the dark side points the here. great city of Taurus covers the entire surface of this planet there is no land to grow food kelp harvests and the creatures of the sea are our only food source a century ago Rising levels of toxic pollution poisoned the oceans, and famine swept the planet. The rich hoarded food for their own use, and the poor were left to starve and die. From what I've seen of Terrace, it doesn't look like much has changed. Except for the upper city, people here are just as bad off as the poor in your little history. But the poor Parts rose the up tent. against this tyranny, and civil war engulfed the planet. Millions died in the fighting, and huge sections of Taurus were destroyed or abandoned. The rebellion was crushed in the end. Thousands were taken prisoner. The jails could not hold them all, and so the practice of banishing all prisoners to the Undercity was born. This is a good way to get some lore um, about Terrace. Are you going to get to the point soon? Say that. Many brave men and women were banished here to the Undercity for their part in the rebellion. People like my father and grandfather were cast down along with their families. What did you expect? If they could get away with it, the Teresian nobles would stuff their own mothers down here to make more room in the Upper City. Now we live a dark existence beneath the streets of Terrace, a life devoid of all hope but one, the Promised Land. And you will be the one to show us the way to get there. Promised Land? What's that? Legends tell of a self-sufficient colony founded just before the famine and lost during the Civil War. A paradise beneath the Undercity, where droid servants tend to every need. For many years, I searched for the Promised Land, the Undercity. just as my grandfather and father did before me. When I became old and gray, my apprentice continued the search on my behalf. Sounds like a myth to me. Something to give the people here some false hope to cling to, so they don't go mad with despair. I have collected many clues hinting at its location. The journal of my apprentice provides yet more information. But still, there are too many pieces missing from this puzzle. But I know my father and grandfather each had journals where they recorded their own discoveries. Perhaps with their journals, I could at last uncover its hidden location. So we have those journals. 
But if I give it to him, I get light side points. There's another guy that's around here. If I give it to him, I get dark side. So I won't tell him that I have them all. Let's act like I don't. Uh, and you want me to find these missing journals? I have nothing to offer if you help me in this. Nothing. I See, we get nothing. I hope the knowledge that you are helping the entire village escape a life of darkness and suffering is reward enough. I'll find those journals. Sorry, I need an actual reward if you want my help. I see. Well, perhaps you are not the savior I seek after <laughs> all. I can only pray that if you find the journals, you will have a change of heart and bring them to me. We'll have a change of heart. All right, sorry, sir. Where's the guy at, the merchant dude? Eye gear. Yeah, we give it to him. I saw you talking with Rukul. He told you his legends about the promised land, didn't he? He told you all about his missing apprentice and the other lost explorers, right? You know, most people don't believe his stories. They figure he's nothing but an old cook. But I think there might be some truth in what he's saying. That's why I want to stop him. Stop him? What are you talking about? For an outcast, I've got things pretty good. The village relies on me to bring in food and supplies. I'm an important man. If it wasn't for Gendar, I'd be running this place. I get the feeling if it wasn't for Gendar, this place would be a lot worse off than it is. But if Rukul ever finds his promised land, I'm sunk. People won't need to rely on me anymore. I'll just be another nobody like all the rest of the villagers. I won't let that happen. Uh, you want me to kill Rukiel? I don't want you to kill Rukul. He's not the problem. It's those damn explorers that went before him. What if they actually found something? They would have recorded that information in their journals. I'll pay you if you bring all three journals to me. The two from the explorers, and the one from Rukul's apprentice. Then I can destroy the evidence and make sure nobody ever finds the promised land. I've saved up enough credits for my business here to make it worth your while if you help me. Sure. Once you have all three journals, just bring them to me and I'll give you a decent reward. Now, was there something else you needed? I have the journals you wanted. I knew Rukul's legend about the promised land were true. Quick, give me those journals so I can destroy them. <laughs> First, hand over those credits you promised. Right. Your reward. Here's 100 credits. That's a pretty hefty payment for some old notes and maps, eh? Only 100 credits? Persuade. You will give me more than a mere 100 credits for this. Well, I don't want Rukul to get his hands on them journals. I'll give you 200 credits. That's all I have. Fine. 200... Credits and some dark side points. Sign me up, I guess. Excellent. Now Rukul will never lead these people to the promised land. Now, is there something else you need? You want to look at my inventory? Uh, what's going on over here? Old man's running. False prophet, deceiver. You have betrayed me. You have sold the hope of the entire village to the selfish and damnable Igiar. All I have worked for is destroyed. All the hopes and dreams of my father and grandfather before him turned to dust. Begone, upworlder. I have only curses to speak at you. How would he know that I found them? How does he know? He just comes running out of nowhere. Dark side points. That's so odd. Like, he shouldn't even have found out that I... Uh... Gave it to this dude. All right, well, we're done down here. There's no need to ever come down here again. So now, from one bad thing to another, we're gonna go and take down the hidden backs. I wonder how Mission is going to feel about this, because 
Um, I think she's down with the hidden banks. She was, because they mentioned her when we first uh, were talking to them. So this is gonna be kind of tough, I think. Going in here and murdering them all. Go in and speak to Gadon if you want. Oh boy, a lot of death coming. End of the Mandalorian War. We have so many people in here we gotta murder. Hidden Beck Guard. Oh yeah, we're supposed to go into his office, I think. Yo. Where's he at? Zerdra. Gadden can't speak to you right now. Brezhix put a price on his head, so I ordered him to stay in his private chambers until we find the assassin. Oh. I'm the assassin, and you're dead. Why would I say that? If I say anything suspicious, I'll let you know. Yes, good. The more people who keep an eye out, the better we'll catch this assassin in time. Where is his, uh... Where is his chambers at? To Lower City. Where is his chambers? In here? All right. I thought the guy said he gave me a key. Oh yeah, it might be right here. What's up, man? Keep your eyes open. Our sources tell us Frederick's plan planning a hit on Gaddon. There could be a Volker or assassin in here right now. Where is Gaddon now? He's in his private chair he won't be coming out until we find that Volker assassin. Yeah, I'll be looking. Security door. So where is the... I could tell these people I'm the assassin and whatnot, but I don't... Don't really want to. I want to find his room so I can go in there. Okay. I'm gonna reload that real fast. I did, I did not know that touching the door was gonna automatically open. You know, it did say it was a security breach, but the door's got to be locked. Y'all can't just have the doors unlocked in here. What's over here? Let me let me talk to her again real fast. Gaden can. Just so I can trigger this. Yes. Save it. Is there a way that I could just go straight to his chambers and get him? I don't I don't really want to have to fight through everybody. But I feel at the moment I touch this guy, it's just it's going down. Frederick is nothing but scum. I don't know why those Volkers follow him. Got him ten times the man he is. Yeah, so it seems that if I just open that war breaks loose. So, here's what we're going to do. We're not going to do this main room, because there's like freaking six people in here. Seven. Eight. Control room is right there. Let's murder these people in here. That way we can work our way out if we need to. Wameji! Where's Gaddon now? You're looking at the Volker assassin, fool. Gilly! Gilly! Bug raccoon! Assassin! Assassin in the base! I think he called me a raccoon as well. Pretty sure he called me a raccoon. Okay, you shoot him. These guys. Oh my god, easy. Y'all some fools, this is easy. Press the disengage button. Okay. That's how we're gonna have to do this. Gonna be a lot of saving. Okay. So let me see sure. now. 
Is everyone is everyone hostile against me? Yeah, they are. Okay. Could send you off into battle just to die. What? Whoa, okay. Kill her. Focus on, on her. I, my character's dead already. He's level two. Karth, please. Karth, what are you doing? Wrong person, Karth. Down you go. Oh my lord, Karth is dead. Okay. Yeah. This is gonna be trouble. Yeah, we're dead. We're dead. There's no way we can win this. Reload. I mean, I want to see what's in that control room. I want to clear this room out first if I can. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Got an idea. Let's do, what's stealth? G? Turn solo mode sure. on. Someone's gonna get hurt. Right? Oh my gosh, she's running. Okay, this guy's coming right over here. So we can just murder him. Oh my, that was terrible. Help. Help me, boys. But my guy, um... Okay, they, yeah, yeah. That's good, that's good. Let them come to us. Go ahead. Ready? Oh, come on, get her. Come on. Woo. 800 big ones. Okay, there's still a couple of guys over here. Hang on. What? Let's draw them over here. Come back, come back, come back. Oh. Hard, please. All right, there we go. We have done yes. it. We have cleared this room. I know there's more enemies back that way. But I want to check the control room first to kind of get a sense of the layout here. I can't believe we got set or 700. We got 800 for killing that woman. Heavy blaster, adrenaline amplifier, military suit. Gonna add some decent stuff. Oh, there's that guy over there. He's looking. He's looking our way. Um, go in here first. Oh! Get him. What? Oh, card. Stop. Kill him. Ooh, nice. Yeah, he's still standing over there, so we'll get him a little bit later. He would sit in this. Yes? Who's got the higher skill what? rate? I think it's, um... I think it's mission? <sighs> Computer use, she's at six. Yeah. Yeah, let's go ahead and log in. Let's see. Security cameras, the bars, nothing there. Barracks? Uh, there's like three guys in there. Elevator. Which... 
We haven't seen that yet. A little bit farther back. Main hall. We just killed everyone there. Okay. System commands. Area schematics. No. Okay. Dang. I thought there was going to be like... It would show us exactly where his room's at. I mean, I could have got the schematics, but... I'm not going to pay... Or not pay, but use four computer spikes when most of it is pretty much mapped. Boom! God, why does that do so little damage? Is his armor like that. just that good? Might need to... I need to change the weapon on uh, mission. I don't know. Blaster rifle. Zal bars. Disruptor. All of this. Hmm, I don't know. Let's see. Okay, we're gonna get ready to go through here. Okay, hang on, I gotta step out for just a moment real fast. Uh I think if I hit this, the camera goes away? Okay. I'll be right back. One second. There you go. Uh, oh, you know me. I'm just slaying. I'm sorry. I don't know what that means. I'm too old to be hip and youthful. I hear you, man. There's so many different terms that people bring up. All these, uh, these youngins. Like, what does that even mean? Can't keep up with all the lingo. Now, when he said, oh, you know me, I'm just slaying. I, uh, I first thought of you know, slaying demons in uh, Dark Souls. That's what I first thought of. Oh yeah, I need to put the camera back. Oop. Oh no! Okay, good. I keep hitting F5 because that's the, the quick save in Cyberpunk and I keep hitting that in this game and th that's quick load. Good thing we're right here, okay. Let's finish this assault on the base here. You put your damn hands up. Yes. Murder this man. Character's dead because he's level two. Car, please. Car, fly. Oh god. Alright, let's see. Let's loot all of this here. Guy doesn't have anything. This dead man? What's that? Okay, where does this go? Elevator? Okay, let's see what's over here. It was a mine. Have what? mission take that. Never mind. I'm just clinging to a past that doesn't exist anymore. This time, aren't we all? We should go back to the good old days. And there wasn't a pandemic. I miss uh, I miss concerts, man. Miss that, I miss going to the movies. You know? And 90s internet, man. Oh god. The the days of dial up, dude. Take the days that. of dial up. Burr, burr. The day the days of dial up sure. in internet forums. Those are, uh, those are my jam. 
been on internet forums. I, I used to be on, uh, because around the time I used to be on an internet forum that was for, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! And that was a lot of fun. Uh, I even think that there was, like, some, like, cheap, cheaply made, um, like, card game. It was Yu-Gi-Oh, but you could, like, duel online with other people. It was, like, some very early, uh, online gaming experience for me. But, uh, it was kind of cool. I don't even know what it was called or uh -huh. what? or anything like that, but it was just like something that somebody had made. It was basically kind of like a mod, I guess. Those, uh, those were the days, the days when I when I cared about being on a forum and I cared about my post count. Keep saving after every door here. Okay, so it looks like Gaddon is going to be down that elevator, and then this is just that hallway where the one dude is at, so we'll just murder him real fast. Hey, stop it! Okay. I think I might need to heal up here. 36 med packs. Yeah, let's uh, heal up a little bit here. Sure. Not my character, what? though. Heal him up a few times there. Huh? Huh? 